Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am now going to do a DIY bridal makeup because I am now married. Yes po, kasal na po ako. So this is my bare face and unahin muna natin ayusin ang aking hair. I'm going to use this Palm Olive Expert Thick Anti-Face Hair Serum. I'm now going to blow dry my hair para medyo magkaroon ng volume and matuloy na rin siya na mabilis. So guys, medyo na-set na yung hair ko. I'm going to clip it and do my skincare. This is the Pixie Glow Tonic and I'm just going to tap it on my face. Next is the Too Faced Serum by The Ordinary. My moisturizer is the Cosr S Advanced Neon 92 All-in-One Cream. It's very lightweight and mabilis din siyang matuyo. Next is this Dear Claire Sunscreen. Um, it's perfect for your oily skin type like me. And pagpasensyahan nyo na po kung may aso tumatawad sa background. I'm going to prep my lips using Lucas Papao Oil. Uh -huh. Nag-oxidize po yung skin ko, acidic po ko, so dapat one shade lighter yung foundation ko. Now I'm going to use this It Cosmetics CC Cream with SPF 50. Kung hindi po ako gagamit ng, gagamit ng concealer, instead ito na lang. Kasi natatakpan nyo ng mabuti yung mga dark spots sa mukha ko. Lalo na yung dark circles under my eyes. I'm now going to blend the products using this small beauty blender. And I just want to say thank you to my husband for giving this to me. Now I'm going to set my face using this loose face powder from Coty Airspa. So hindi masyadong baking yung ginawa ko. Sakto lang. Binasa ko lang konti yung sponge uh, using the MAC setting spray. So for my eyes, I'm going to use this Weva Cocoa Blend Eyeshadow Palette. So ito guys, hindi ko mahanap yung blending brush ko. Itong ginamit ko medyo slant siya. So hindi talaga ito yung para sa pang blend ng mata. Yun yun. Um, ginawan ko na lang din siya ng paraan para magkaroon ng transition colors. Next, I'm going to use a darker shade color para magkaroon ng konting shape yung mata ko. Again, ang hirap na hindi gumagamit ng blending brush. By the way guys, disclaimer lang po, hindi po ako professional makeup artist. I was once a freelance makeup artist. Itong mga techniques na ginagawa ko sa sarili ko, mga natutunan ko lang din po noon, and sa konting workshops na napuntahan ko. If magiging okay sa inyong technique na to, then good. But sa tingin nyo, hindi nyo, hindi kayo in favor dito sa ginagawa ko. Okay lang naman po. Ito po yung nag-work para sa akin. For the next color, I'm going to use the warm notes. Kami ako napapanood ng mga YouTube tutorials na inuuna nila minsan yung kanilang eyes before their face. Kayo guys, ano ba mas prefer nyo? Maglagay muna ng foundation or maglagay muna ng eyeshadow? Comment down below! Again and again, sobrang hirap nang walang blending brush. As in... <laughs> So 
for my favorite part, I'm now going to put shimmer on my eyes. This is the Becca Shimmer Skin Perfector. Press highlight in the color champagne pop. So bang love ko to. And ngayon ko lang appreciate yung mga glittery and shimmer eyeshadows na yung pangalit kasi matamata lang din yung labi niya. We're putting another glow from Fenty Beauty Kilowatt Highlighter Duo. This is my everyday eyeshadow. Another favorite of mine is this Mercy First Gel Eyeliner in the color Dutch Brown. Ito waterproof siya and hindi ako gagamit ng liquid eyeliner para soft lang din yung dating ng eyes ko. And ito, sobrang ganda nito and sa Shopee ko lang nakuha. Sobrang bilis ng shipping from Korea and ang dami niyang freebies. Okay guys, the best tong eyeliner na to. Umiha ko nung civil wedding namin at walang smudge or anything. Tapos syempre pinagpawisan din ako at okay siya. As in okay. going to curl and use mascara for my eyelashes kasi naubos na yung falsies ko pero meron akong gamit na falsies noon for my eyebrows I'm going to use my OG into it uh, brow powder duo Ito, sobrang ganun to. I've been using this since 2013. Thanks to my Rumi Alex. Hi! For my brow mascara, I'm going to use this Tevian mascara. Kasi yung brow mascara na meron ako is color bell and hindi siya match sa hair color ko. And then, I'm going to use this Becca Ignite Liquified Light Highlighter. So for my blush, I'm going to use this O2O Liquid Blush. Ilalagay ko siya sa may cheekbone ko kahit wala masyadong cheekbones para magkaroon ng definition konti. I'm now going to use again the Becca Highlighting Powder. I'm going to use another blush from Perfect Diary the Satin Touch Cream Blush Duo in the color 03. For my lips, I'm going to use the Sephora Lip Stain Liner in the shade 02. I'm now going to use the Makeup Forever Artist Nude Cream. So, ganda nito guys. And then, another shade is the Sunny's Fluff Mate Vicky. going to set my face using this Max Studio Fix Powder Plus Foundation in the shade NC25. Last step is this MAC Watermelon Prep and Prime Setting Spray. And then, konting ayos na din ng hair. So, hindi rin po ako hair stylist. So, simple lang din itong ginawa ko sa hair ko. This is it. I finally recreated my civil wedding makeup. For me, this is a very simple look and I love it. My husband loved it and my friends as well. So, ito siya guys. Pwede nyo rin siyang gawin as an everyday makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed my makeup tutorial. I'm now going to share some photos and videos from our wedding day. Enjoy! Please don't forget to like and subscribe 
and see you next time. Happy New Year!